Yo, what's good? It's your boy TRNT, and I'm back one more again. This time I'm back with a brand new segment called New Music Friday, where I'm checking out brand new song that just got released. We may do some singles, albums, depending on what we getting into. But anywho, unlike the other YouTubers and reactors, I do not skip the song. I do not pause the song. I listen to the whole song, and at the end, I get my commentary. I grade each song from zero to ten, ten being the best. So if it's a trash song, y'all already know that's five and below. If it's mid, average, okay, that's a six. Now, if it's a good song, depending on how good I think it is, and y'all, that's seven to ten. So make sure y'all stay tuned to the end of each video. Make sure y'all like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to leave y'all grade. You dig? Because when we get the 10K subs, there will be a Cash App giveaway after every reaction. So make sure y'all sub. But anywho, this is New Music Friday. Catch me by. You fucking on a bunch of making reaction bits. <laughs> I hate you niggas that make reaction bits. Hey, this is my two beats. Mine and Leo. Hey, Kyle Tash is a Christian featuring Tommy. Son of a Baby. First caught winning her a couple of years ago. She opened up for Burner Boy. He came to H Time, did a little festival. You know what I'm saying? And um, she had she had a live ass performance, and I was up there like she's somebody to watch. And um, a couple of years later, she doing her thing, still doing it. I think she's next to blow. Like right now, especially in Houston, a lot of female artists, a lot of female artists getting they shine on. Like you know, we got I already got Meg. You know what I'm saying? She our biggest superstar rap wise as far as right now. And uh you got Ken the man, you know what I'm saying? Um and then you got Mona Leo and shout out to the other girls coming up. They on their way. But um yeah, I found out she uh stunned for Vegas baby mama and even I reacted to his music when he first came out with the baby, but he did take a time out. You know what I'm saying? He still rapping like he never lost a step, but it, he took a time out. So it was like, that's what he was doing. He was laid up. She turned the street nigga to a house nigga. He in the video with his motherfucking, um, what do you think called Crocs? I ain't even know them things called jibbits, but that's what 
being in love and being in a relationship do. You you walk around with your girl, y'all got y'all crocs on and shit, and you just y'all just rocking out, doing y'all thing. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But it's dope that they both young, they both up and coming, and they both can rap. I don't know. Hopefully they can last for his relationships, you know what I'm saying, blessings to them. But I feel like she's going to be next. She got staying power. Her f bar is hard. Uh, I think people fuck with it. So 0 out of 10, I'm going to get this an 8.8. .8. 0 out of 10, it's an 8.8. .8. It's not a 9. It's not something I would add to my playlist right now. But if I check out more of her music and it go well, you know what I'm saying, I might add it. So for right now, it's an 8.8. .8. Anywho. We're going to do one more song, then we're going to go to Twitch. So, if y'all rocking out with me, click that next video. Don't forget to leave your grade. If not, I'm...